Welcome to Perth in Western Australia. Oh, it's so nice here. Look at that, guys. So, today I'm at the Seasons of Perth which is cheapish and in the middle of the city. So yeah, I guess I'm paying for the location, but not really for the quality of the room. <laughs> yeah, even the TV says. <laughs> so yeah, the views aren't that great either. And the bathroom is weird. It has like this, this thing here and then, yeah, the sink and the bathtub, even though I love having a bath, but it was not inviting, I have to say. So yeah, that's the seasons of Perth. That's all you need to know. But I mean, I slept well. And the bed was actually okay. Good morning, reporting to you live from Perth. It is hot. I know I keep saying that, but everywhere I go, it's hot. I don't know, it's not my fault. And I'm going to head out for breakfast. Apparently there's an amazing vegan dessert place somewhere up there where they have like waffles and pancakes. I haven't had waffles and pancakes for ages. So let's check out this place. Nice and sunny day. And it's very quiet. Also yesterday when I was walking home with my luggage from the train, it was so quiet, there were hardly any people. It was almost spooky and I did not feel very safe because those few people that were around were a little bit dodgy. But it's all good now, even though it's still very, very quiet here. I guess, especially compared to Kuala Lumpur, <laughs> where it is, it's a busy city, Perth is just very sleepy. And it is now 10.15 in the morning and I mean, it looks more like 6 a.m. people-wise. Sun-wise, it's like, yeah, more like noon-ish. Anyway, I need a cup of tea because otherwise I just talk weird stuff. <laughs> Well, there you have it, Perth. It is very nice though, I like it. Cute country town. Ooh, Lord of the Fries. I might have lunch there, even though I had a burger yesterday. Well, yeah, Lord of the Fries has amazing burgers and fries. Nice, very nice. I've been here before several times on tour with my orchestra and I've been here once coming back from an around the world trip and I had like 10 hours or something during the day to kill. Yet I don't recognize any of the things I'm seeing right now. I don't think I have been in this neck of the woods. It's pretty nice. Ah, okay, what is it called here? North Bridge, North Bridge. Where are we? Hmm, who knows? Nice street art. There is barely any traffic here. Like you can cross the streets all the time. You don't have to wait for the lights to turn green, which of course I wouldn't like. I'm doing everything very legally here. But just saying you could if you want to there is hardly any traffic see empty 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 now i'm ready for my tea even though i need to cool down first okay i'm going towards north bridge piazza let's see i think somewhere here is the place that i want to go to or maybe not i think i found it how cool Lion walk. This better be it. Thank 
you so much. It was amazing. Oh my God, they are so nice there. The owner is so nice and the guy who made my food is so nice and they might subscribe to my YouTube channel. So if you're seeing this, hi, love you guys. Best breakfast I've ever had. I'm completely stuffed because <laughs> I ordered two things because I just wanted to see and I didn't want to miss out on anything. But oh my God, this place, this might be the best vegan cafe I've ever been to because they've got so many cakes and so many sweets. So this is exactly the stuff that I like for breakfast. But then there's also fruit and the, the um, coca chia pudding. <gasps> oh, so good. And I guess healthy. So amazing. If you come to Perth, do not miss out on this. It's called Flora and Fauna. Oh, there's a turtle street art. I mean, does this day get any better? Did you just paint that? Sorry. No. No, oh, we're okay. just cleaning it. Oh, cleaning it, but yeah. it's so. But this is so nice. Don't clean this. Yeah, no, no. As in, we're cleaning this, this, this stuff. We're ah, cleaning okay, up. the ugly stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah but yeah, not yeah. the turtle. But not the turtle. Oh, okay, okay, <laughs> perfect. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, so <clears throat> they are not cleaning the turtle. Thank God. Lots of street art here. I love this. Now I want to move to Perth, and I want to live right here and then eat at this cafe all the time. There goes my diet. But I can just do the chia pudding. Some ancient Egyptian stuff happening here. <laughs> the place to be in Perth. Look how cool this area is. Bird bath. hang out here I really wanted I wanted to have an experience you know I said hey guys I really want to have an experience with water actually I want to experience something can you I want to have an experience too. I actually think I'm having an experience already. I'm gonna explore Wonderland. Oh, it's so nice here. Look at that, guys. Perth is cool after all. And it's not crowded. And I love non-crowded places. So why am I not moving here? Right now I cannot see a reason at all. Love it! I mean, hello! What a cool store! bathroom is in here <laughs> so pretty wow I like pretty bathrooms <laughs> and there you have it Okay, I've been sitting inside this museum now for three hours editing like crazy my Kuala Lumpur video. So please check out that episode. I've been working really quickly, but I think it turned out pretty well. And now I'm heading back to my hotel. 
very nice building we've got here heading back to my hotel collecting my things especially my viola because i will need that because i'm going to perform on queen mary cruise ship and that means i will go to, to the cruise ship ferry terminal in Fremantle and there i will be boarding the cruise ship so i'm sad that i don't have more time to spend here it's so nice i'm really a big fan I think I will be coming back to Perth soon now that I know how nice it is but I might be coming back here in like autumn or winter <laughs> enough heat traffic in Perth <laughs> so if you don't like crowds and if you don't like being stuck in traffic Perth is the perfect place for you it's amazing also I came here with the airport train which is brand new it's it's so new it smells like it has like new car smell on new trains now and I think it is down there don't know if you can see it now and it was really nice Here is the pedestrian area. We do not have time to check that out yet, but it has shops. I've been there before and it is very nice. <laughs> and in case you wanted to know where the electricity and gas department of Perth was, there, there it is. Some air conditioned passage that I just found. I'm not sure if it's a shortcut to my hotel. I actually wanted to get my eyebrows done, so I apologize for my horrible eyebrows. Oh wow, I could really do with the haircuts, but do we have time? No, we don't. Guys, I promise, once I'm monetized, which is gonna happen soon because I, I'm halfway there, so please subscribe, please give it a like. Once I'm there, I promise there will be way more traveling and it won't be as like improvised and as quick and as like just one day trips. Look how nice this is. So yeah, there will be much more coming for you guys. So yes, if you want to support me, all it takes to hit subscribe. That's all. It costs you nothing. It makes a huge difference for me. What do we have here? City of Perth Library. There you go. People are staring at me. Yes, I am a famous YouTuber, you guys. Is Perth up and coming? I say, yes, it is. It's very cool. Am I lost and don't know where my hotel is? Yes. But I found something that my friend Nasli would love, Croissant Express. Should her get her one? Nah, she can get them on the ship. Okay, hotel. Where are you? So, yes, I'm staying at the Seasons of Perth, which sounds so fancy. It sounds like Four Seasons, but like their logo looks like a bat. <laughs> and that says all about, you need to know about this hotel. Hello. Oh, Godfather Barbershop. Turns out I went too far. It happens, I do that. And <laughs> and now I need to walk back and my hotel should be somewhere. Oh yeah, there it is. The logo of a crab. <laughs> I'll show you. I'm sure you'll agree. It's like a crab flower. And there we have it. Seasons of Perth. And that's the lobby. Oh, there's a pool. Hold on, I'll show you guys. I've seen it last night. It was not very inviting. Still not very inviting. So that's that. <laughs> and 
now I'm picking up my luggage. Okay, so here we go. Lots of luggage and going to the central station towards the train. I can barely move this thing. Hi. So much for traveling light. Check this out. Perth back in the day. Even emptier, but already they had a train. And look at those cool dudes. There you go. train and now I'm getting on this ship <laughs> and this is it I'm about to get on the ship now first impression of the ship wow look at this this is where the lifts are very fancy oh almost missed my lift there eh? I can't wait for a shower and going to the pool pretty fancy Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. That's why Nasli said, did you watch my videos? She sent me a video of the room because she's been here earlier because look, oh my god. We got a window. I am actually gonna cry. Oh my god. This is just so cool. Wow. I'm, I'm actually crying. Oh my god. This is amazing. This is this changes everything. This changes everything. It's so hard to wake up otherwise. Now they're gonna tell me I'm in the wrong room. This is the bridge. For exercise, for exercise, for exercise. Okay, the I'm gonna exercise. Emergency alarm signal is about to be sounded. Gonna go to the gym. So as I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted by that announcement. I'm gonna unpack or maybe I go to the pool first. I think I'm gonna go to the pool first. I've earned it.